Hello, and welcome to more games with Mr. Faber. Is that too loud? That's a little loud. Probably not for you guys, but it's loud in the ears. Let's turn that down at least. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. It looks a little loud on the audio too, so we'll turn this down. Let's go to master volume. Ah, no, 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 not master volume. Music volume. Dave, fantastic. All right, so. Uh, a friend of mine, Micah, had said that he wanted to see more uh, uh, a video, whatever, uh, uh, webcam thing. So here we go. I got a webcam going on. All right. Fantastic. Um, so this is Ark. Uh, if you haven't heard of it, it's definitely a AAA game. It's a fantastic game. I love it. Um, I, and we're just going to jump right in. Uh, this game is actually kind of interesting because, uh, you know what, let me just try and grab a new art. Uh, it's very difficult, like, right now I started playing a game with, uh, with someone, and so, uh, it's there. Like, it's, it's not under a save file or whatever, it's just there, and I gotta delete the file if I wanna reset it or stuff like that, so that's kind of interesting. Um, I've never played any of these, these are all new since it first came out, and you got all these different things to change so if you want to be faster or slower or whatever so I'm going to be for the sake of the game yeah multiplier three taming speed three I mean we could even do four I guess just to go faster through see see kind of what is available in the game uh, for sure dino harvesting harvest amount so yeah that's fine 2.5 2.5.05. Wow, we're just not going to do it. Excellent. Took a picture there. Good, good, good. And all that fun stuff. So, well, let's go ahead and jump right in. Uh, yeah, I'm doing the damage higher than lower. We're going to try and face off some pretty dangerous uh, uh, dinosaurs. Oh, yeah. See, there you go. I got to buy the Genesis Pass. All right, fantastic. How about Scorched? Yep, gotta buy that one too. What about Aberration? Do you think we gotta... Yeah, I gotta buy that one too. Okay, Extinction? Good night, Ark. Okay, we know you're awesome, but does that really mean you gotta extort us? Alright, I'm gonna delete this because we're not really seriously playing. So we we'll just start over in the island. Fantastic. Jump right in. So, we are jumping into Ark. Ark is a survival game. It's kind of like Seven Days to Die, except replace zombies with dinosaurs. Ha ha ha. Uh, okay, cool. They they actually had changed this, um, where before uh, they didn't tell you that the zones were easy or medium or hard, um, but now, of course, we have that. Let's go into the east zone, because actually the reason the north zone is so hard is because up there is where the, um, where iron is, and we're going to need iron. Um, can I respawn? I don't want to create a new guy again. Okay, here we go. All right, so, of course, you wake up. Look at your hands. There we go. Holy mother of goodness. All right, those guys are not dangerous, so. Good night, man. It's a little scary, though. So we got some dinosaurs. Um, let's see. Can I punch this? Can I pick this up? I'm picking this up. All right, we got fiber. That is a wild... Dim, 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 dim. All right, so we're going to grab some plants because we're going to need some fiber. Fiber's good. Fiber's good for us. We got all these different berries we're picking up. All right, all right. Already about to level up. Fantastic. <laughs> because of the nar the multiplier people, all right? The multiplier. Did we level up already? No, we're about to. Okay. Um, so this game is, uh, um, you know, I uh, my favorite. I, I do like survival games. My favorite game, you know, Seven Days to Die as far as these style games go. Um you're kind of available to build a lot of stuff. There is a skill tree. Uh, with this game, let's open up uh, our level up thing. We first get to level up this stuff, um, which is interesting because all my previous levels, oh, look at this. So this is my character from my last map. And even though the map was deleted, apparently the uh, character is not. So fantastic. Let's uh, go ahead and bump up health a little bit, you know? Uh, and so you get these uh, uh, Ingrams, I think it's called, yeah, Ingram points, and you slowly unlock things. So, like, we just saw this Fomo... Fiomira? 
uh, walking around. So we're going to make a saddle for that because we'd like to we'd like to have uh, animals doing work for us. So let's do that. Let's do that. I'm going to bring the microphone closer to me too. Is that better? Maybe a little too better. All right. Um, and there's all this stuff that we can get, like wooden wood frame, uh, wooden window frames, stuff like that. I already got the wooden raft because I was next to the water before. And um, that's kind of the way the RPG element is. The idea is supposed to be the idea that they were trying to pe uh, bring is that you shouldn't play this game alone necessarily. So for me, I can be working on boots and uh, and clothing. And you, my friend, can be working on stone foundations, stuff like that. We can all, like, sort of help each other out. So I think that's the purpose behind that. But they do offer, like, there is a ton of stuff for you to be able to um, to get. Right, so we're going to learn that. And if they're yellow, then you have to, there's other things up here, prerequisites you got to get. So, like, this costs four points, but it's going to, I'm going to have to learn the sloped, uh, prerequisites the sloped wooden roof so then it'll be eight points in all so and then i'm spending more um i'm not gonna spend a whole lot of time doing that though i'm gonna jump out of that and we're gonna go back to collecting materials and we gotta do the old-fashioned punch a tree get some material for that where's where's the wood where's wood around here where's wood around these bars I'm a little nervous because this medium level, and I'm not looking up so often. This medium level, uh, there's going to be a lot. Even in the beginner level, you have uh, creatures that will uh, possibly eat you, and that's not that's not good. Um, I don't know if this is something that has to be taught, but animals eating you, not a good thing. Not a good thing. Now the thing that's kind of cool about this. Uh, Survival. Whoa! Whoa! Don't scare me. Oh no. If he's running, what is he running from? I don't have any tools. Um, the thing that's kind of cool about this game is that, uh, you know, Seven Days to Die, the way that you progress is you get uh, higher leveled, um, higher leveled uh, w weaponry, for example, and you slowly build yourself a nice, uh, a nice uh, defensive whatever thing. Uh, here, you actually tame animals, and you can tame more and more dinosaurs. So we're going to try, actually, what in the name of goodness is that? That is a diseased leech. Do I have anything that I can fight this leech with? Because he is not... Ah! Oh, it's on me! How do you get it off? <laughs> Oh, gross. Can I put it in the water? Get off me. <laughs> oh, crap. Can I, how do you get this thing? Yeah! Oh, that is the grossest thing I've ever seen. Uh, what is this even? Can I get this off? No. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I got a leech on me. Oh, man. Oh dear! I don't know how to get this thing off. Is this getting it off? Whacking it with it? No, the tree's just maybe it's not used to this. This is so gross. Ugh. I want it. I want an axe. I want a pick. I want something. Can I, I get this rock thing? No, no. Okay, fine. Fine. Oh my gosh! Cannot even believe this. Where's where's a uh, stone man? There's no stone around here. This is not a great place for stone. I kind of want to go north, but I'm a little nervous because you know it's up north. <laughs> oh, ah. It's gonna drive me crazy. Just, how do I get it off? I'm not ready to. So this is one thing you can do. There's a button. So that you can defecate. And you actually use the... Oh, shoot. I don't know what that thing is. Oh, I know what that is. Do you see that? Oh my gosh, do you see that? That is like a giant snake. Oh, fruitcakes, man. Giant snake. Um, I don't really want to play with the giant snake right now. 
Oh, man, do you see this force, too? Like, everything about this game, uh, you know, like, it's friendlier as in it's brighter. There's lots of life. Like, there's there's life right in there, right? You can see all that, and that's amazing. But at the same time, um, they make sure that you're a little scared. Like, going into this forest... Shoot. I think that's... That is. That might be a dangerous bird. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, but yeah, they just—they really make sure that you feel wary. Like you shouldn't be walking into a dark forest. Golly. Um, you shouldn't be walking into a dark forest just like eh, whatever. Like, uh, the Seven Days to Die, first of all, their forests uh, aren't really black, uh, dark. Uh, in fact, most of these RPGs are not. But, like, you can see here, this forest is really, really dark. Shoot! Bees! Big bees! Can you... Big bees! Oh! <laughs> What's with the antics in this game? <laughs> um, am I about to die? Okay, eat food, eat food. Eat berries, man. Chop up this stuff. We got raw meat from that. No! Get back, you beetle bungy! Ah! I'm gonna die from beetles! Oh my gosh! Oh, shoot. Okay, you're not... You're, you're friendly, right? You just don't want me to attack you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Can I get a little more health here? No, just turn it. Close it right now. See, this is my health. I've got 12 health. Can I eat something? I'm eating food. Yeah, I know I'm down. Is the food going? It's not even helping me go up. How do I? I'm gonna die, you guys. I'm gonna die from this stupid leech. I'm gonna die from... Oh my gosh. I don't know how to heal myself. Okay, well, this has been fun. This is what not to do. I'm gonna drop down here because when I die, yeah, okay. When I die, I want to be able to pick up my leftovers. <sighs> uh, okay, just respawn in the same place. Um, oh, no. Come on. No. No. No, I want the <laughs> leech to go away. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let's see. Let's just take a look-see, okay? Can I... Uh, uh, geez, that thing scares me, too. What can I, I... I lost everything. Of course. Of course. Damn. Oh. Oh, but it doesn't show the leech. Do you see that? Do you see that? Okay, now I want you to imagine, because they do have them here. I want you to imagine a T-Rex. What in the world? A T-Rex chasing you, uh, and the ground... Shoot! Oh man, this is not a good start. Snake, can I pick this up quickly? Ah! So, yeah, this is fun. This is fun. Love the snake. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh! It's not an easy game. I'll tell you that right now. Let's just bring the snake over here. If you're gonna, oh, the snake stop following me. You're you're gonna guard my. Oh, this is dangerous, too. He spits poison. Fruitcakes, man. So, maybe medium doesn't really mean medium. Maybe it means, like, freaking hard. All right, you know what? Just gonna... I'm gonna punch you, man. I'm gonna punch you. Yeah, there we go. All right, he's unconscious. You know what? This is gonna help us. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna go ahead and do that. All right. No, I'm fine. All right, so he's unconscious. We can see this right here. Uh, right there, unconscious. This is a wild female Dilophosaur, level 11. So what we're going to do um, is we're going to try and get some rocks quick because I need some kind of... Shoot, man, there's no rocks! I need some kind of weapon. I need to make some kind of weapon. And uh, I'm going to have to punch this thing. All right, there we go. Um, oh, oh, this thing is gone. Dang it. Oh, so help me if this snake eats my...
poor Dilophosaurus. Yeah, come after me, you stupid snake. Run, 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 run! Did you hear that? Oh, rock. Can I make... I can make it. Oh, I forgot that I... What is this thing doing? Okay, where is this snake? Okay, we're gonna try and grab the stuff again. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Grab all. How do I grab all? Take all? No, drop all. No, no, switch it. Yes. Quickly! No! <laughs> Okay, that was my that was my mom. That was that was a mom move right there. What what happened? Oh, I'm not dead. I'm just passed out. Oh, the snake bite. Unbelievable. If this snake comes and meets eats me. No, he's not. I got to wait for the this thing right here on the side. I can't even open up my board. But if you look over there on the the right-hand side, the little stars, that's torpidity. That's like knockoutness. So, shoot, man. Careful. There's like a hundred ways to die when there's um, zombies. When there's a... Uh... Oh, I'm awake. Okay, yeah, you're hot. Jeez, my gosh. Alright, I got some raw meat. Now let's get over here. This Dilophosaurus is going to help me stay alive before he wakes up. Come on, man. Alright, let's feed him some meat. Alright. Name your Dilophosaurus. We're going to call you Betty. Hey, Betty. Betty, I want you to protect me. Okay, Betty? Betty! Snake! Betty! Get the snake! Come on, Betty! What are you doing? Get the snake! Get the snake! Please, Betty! Please, Betty! Get the snake! No, Betty! Oh. Okay, let's come back, see if Betty made it. Oh, Betty, please be alive! Yeah, stop looking at your hands! Why do you always look at your hands? Oh, uh, where are we? Where were we? They always spawn you randomly, which I guess makes sense. That's not the right place. Can I see a map? Oh, shoot. That's the other thing. There is no, like, definite map. Which is kind of annoying. Oh, there it is. There it is. I kind of figured. Lovely. Freak. Oh, Betty's gone. Betty's gone, and that stupid snake gets to live. Oh, Betty, you made it. Look, Betty... Girl! Um, yeah, well done, Anya, for surviving. Okay, how about this? Can we do more options? Behavior. I want you to enable mating, enable wandering, turn left, disable, change to ignore group whistles. What? I set stance, attack your target. Aggressive. I want you aggressive, Betty. Okay, go, Betty, go! Oh, thank goodness. Alright, come on, snake. There's two of them! Son of a bird, you're my chimney. Oh my gosh! Oh, did we kill one of them? Oh, I'm knocked out. This is just no good. This is no good. Betty, nice job. Kill the other one. Kill the other one. Come on, Betty, you got this. You got this, Betty. You got this! No! <laughs> oh, man, don't kill Betty, though. Don't kill Betty. If you're gonna do it, take me. Take my body <laughs> don't take Betty please don't take Betty where where oh I always get turned around is it this way is it this way no, really this way this way maybe this way oh that's water uh, by the way there's megalodons here so if you have a fear of underwater creatures Continue to be scared. All right, let's get out. Out, oh, yeah, out, uh, 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 Okay. Betty! Betty! Oh, fruitcakes. That's no good. Good night, man. I'm not really spawned in the medium area. And frankly, there's a reason for that. What the, the freaking... Those are piranhas. Those are piranhas that are just chilling. Betty! Betty! Please tell me she survived. I don't see the snakes. I don't see Betty either. I see frogs. Is this the right place? I don't think this is the right place. I feel like it's it's supposed to be the right place. <gasps> no! No, Betty, no! <laughs> nope, that's not Betty. That's an unconscious metal lock, you know. Hmm. Except I have no meat to feed this one. Hey! No, Betty, no! 
Why, Betty? Why did they do this to you? Oh, you're unconscious. You're still alive, though. All right, let's give you more health. And uh, maybe, oh, maybe more wood. Oh, you piece of junk! Son of a gun! I hate these snakes! Ugh! Go away! <laughs> Oh, he's gonna eat me again. He's going to eat me again. So... Maybe we should spawn away. Clearly, um, my gifts and talents for medium level is just not hitting it. And I really wanted to show you guys what scary looks like. So, I did. <laughs> I showed you scary. You guys want to see really hard? Let's just, let's just jump in there really quick. Because if I can't even do medium, let's just see what un really hard is. Betty, I'm so sorry. Girl, I am so sorry. We're going to have to abandon you. Because we're going to go to easy after this. This doesn't look so bad. There's more rock. Thank goodness. Do I have more rock to pick up? Yes, yes, okay. Rocks to pick up. How about wood? Yes, wood. So Resource-wise, this place is way better. Sheesh. I could not get anything over there, man. And that's that's like crucial. Like you gotta get, you gotta get yourself like the you gotta get the pickaxe. The pickaxe gets you uh, flint right here. Just by chopping at that, so that you can get like an axe, maybe a spear. No, okay, that's fine. Boom! Oh, we got some metal too. All right, come on, keep hacking, keep hacking. Yeah, there we go. Pop that. Okay. If you're playing this multiplayer, by the way, that those rock. Um, explosions they they do they go blasting everywhere so uh, if you're trying to hide don't chop up a rock and actually finish off chopping it up you know otherwise you're gonna get yourself in trouble the other thing I really don't like oh now we got it uh, is you can't uh, you can't chop down uh, like um, grassy stuff and you can't pick it up while holding a, 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 um, a hatchet which kind of sucks but whatever yeah, that's cool uh, I won't complain I guess Yay, level up. So let's see what happens. We're chopping at this thing. Choppity, choppity, chop. Choppity, chop. And uh, we're going to go here and we're going to say, let's uh, let's improve our... Jeez, I'd improve my torpidity if I could. Get back to Betty. But no. No, no. Can't do that. All right. Uh, let's keep chopping. Chop, chop, chop. All right, let's see. When is it going to explode? Come on. Come on, there we go. Boom, look at that. Boom, all over the place. You know, not even nothing. <laughs> okay. Wow, that is a big bird. Can I throw? Oh, I missed. And I used up my spear. Probably should be better with the spears. All right, let's go ahead and do some building, hey? Because that's going to be important. Uh, let's see, what can we build? What can we build? We could do a thatch place, we could do a wooden place, or we could do a stone place, because I did research the stone thing. Um, stone's going to take a lot of stone. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. Stone's going to take a lot of stone. The other thing that's really interesting is that apparently an axe will get you a lot more stone. Instead of a pickaxe. So this is kind of how it works. The, uh, the axe and the pickaxe counter each other. So there's always, like, two resources you get from this stuff. Like, uh, the, the stone you get flint and... Uh, stone. And so if you want more flint, then you've got to use the pickaxe. If you want more stone, then you use the axe. If you want more wood, you use the axe. If you want more thatch, then you use the pickaxe. And it just sort of is like that contradictory thing. So there's going to be some animals uh, you can collect. Uh, uh, like if we didn't want to kill, if we wanted to kill Betty, we could have gotten raw meat from her and. Um, uh, raw meat and uh, let, uh, hide. And if you wanted more raw meat, then you use the pickaxe. If you want more hide, you use the axe. So I, I don't know if I like that. Oops. Uh, it's definitely different. Like you don't see that in, in normal normal games like this. So and encumbered. Okay. So like any good game, I'm gonna just keep chopping. What is that thing though? Keep my eye up to the corner. Um, like every good game, uh, you slowly become encumbered, and in this case, I am over the limit, which means I cannot move. Like I'm trying to, I'm pressing WASD. No, 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 no! Don't do this now. Is he flying? Are you attacking me from up high? That just sucks, man. 
Let's see. Let's see. I got him! Oh, yeah! Nailed it! See, I mean, I'm not surprised, really. I'm just really good at this stuff. Okay, I did melee, and let's go ahead and actually get un unencumbered, because apparently when you build stuff like rock and thingy, no dollars, mm -hmm. then uh, you become less encumbered. I mean, that, that just is natural, right? Let's put you in three. I guess that's where the spear was, but oh well. Let's put ourselves down here. Boom. Right there. Fantastic. I need one other, really? It's just ridiculous, man. Oh, man. Raining. There we go. We got some stone foundation. And just in time for us to wrap up. Uh, excuse me. Wrap up this video, Hey, eh? That was fun. So, if you have been enjoying this, be sure to like and... I'm just kidding. I gotta, I gotta stop with that joke. That one's just getting old. Um, but seriously, this is a this is a really uh, fun game. Uh, I I like Seven Days because uh, of the a little bit more control I guess you have of the uh, fear. Uh, whereas here, my goodness, you really even on the easy levels you really do um, get sort of thrown into the thick of it. And the general rule of thumb, which I mean, I'm kind of surprised they put us so close to the ocean, uh, but the general rule of thumb is that. The uh, closer to the middle of the island you are, the more dangerous it gets. So, um, I guess to, to... I mean, since building is not such a big deal, because it's kind of like most other building building things. Um, I mean, I do like the wider... Uh, you know, the just non-Minecraft kind of building situation. What is this thing? This is a, a dead animal. I'll chop it up for meat. All right, so let's go ahead and see if we can find ourselves a nice big shark, like a Megalodon right there. You can see that. Isn't that fun? And not at all a little bit scary. Can you imagine? Actually, i got to look side to side, because I've done this, where you see a big Megalodon, and then all of a sudden you turn to the side, and what the heck? He's coming at me from the side, or a friend of his, or something like that. So that's your Megalodon there. I'm going to come out of the water, because... Over here on the side, I'm icy cold, and that means lowering health. Oh, and I'm losing oxygen. You know, small things, right? Uh, you can drink the water. It's not unhealthy to drink the water fresh. And uh, let's just... Uh, I'm going to do movement, because what I'm going to do now... Uh, even though I would never do this in real life, but for your sake... For your sake, my dear audience... We're going to run into the, as far into the um, inland as we can. We're going to go as far inland as we can. And hopefully try and find some scary monstrous Tyrannosaurus Rex or something just as scary. Like that thing. Or is that a rock? That's a rock. Ah, oh, there's a Triceratops. Cute, huh? Cute. Level 1, too. I would definitely uh, make him a pet. If we were, um, if this was a game uh, that I was um, spending more time in. Lovely, lovely. And the thing that I do like about these forests, because they are dark and creepy, like going in here, it's just super, super creepy. But uh, you can actually tear down the forest a uh, little by little and, uh, you know, sort of uh, make it not so creepy. You can deforest the place if you want to. Um, and that is kind of nice because then you, uh, sorry, had to go to the bathroom there. Um, that is really nice because then you don't have to, uh, um, necessarily just do what I'm doing, which is, like, I'm trying not to look to the side too much. Because I know something's gonna jump out and scare me, you know, like that, so. I'm just trying to get to another, cl a clear inland area. But this is definitely not the way that you should go. If you are trying to survive. Okay. Creepy, creepy stuff. Alright, we've got some grassland up here. And some stony, stony areas. Oh my. Did we run into... Are you kidding me right now? No! Oh, I... Oh, man. This is iron. These are iron... These are iron deposits, man. Oh my gosh. Oh, I, I need to quit. I need to quit, but I ran into, by accident, I ran into... Okay, did you see that? 
I think that was a raptor. I think that was a raptor. Pretty sure. Yep. That's a raptor. And those things are scary on so many different levels. One being that they're fast. <laughs> and the other being that they're freaking deadly. Oh shoot, there's like a raptor party going on. Let's let's go a little bit further up, you know, see what's what You didn't see me, right? Okay. I think I'm safe, said the last words of a man looking to die, right? Okay, you just don't say those things. Um, with the metal, I don't think you get more metal with this. I'm really nervous that they're going to come out there. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I get more iron. I do know for a fact that, uh, I'm slowed. I do know for a fact that you do get better, um, iron collection once you have an iron... Uh, you get better iron collecting um, from these rocks once uh, you are um, building iron tools. I do know that. There we go. Um, okay, so unfortunately we are going up the hill, which is exactly if you ever play this game um, and you're trying to figure out where should I where should I uh, go for for iron, you go to the hill, the the mountain. That is the place for it. Why? Why can't I build there? I don't understand. Why are you? Why are you not letting me do that? That's fine. I'm just trying to ditch stuff so I can run because I've realized the point in the next one minute, or not. No, we're way past time anyway. All right, that's fine. Um, yeah, this game is is extremely fun. If you don't like that jump factor, that uh, fear factor, um, because you're going to have just such a variety of animals, and some of them will just just pounce on you. Oh, look at that. Jaguars. And I have running skills. But I don't think I have that much running skills. Like, can I turn around? Is it right on me? <laughs> so, you know, not to be over dramatic or anything, but <laughs> I'm going to break my leg. <laughs> it is a fun game if you can handle the jump scares. And if you don't like the jump scares, then start in the easy zone, find a friend, build yourself up. Like, there's a bunch of... You're not going to get a ton of iron quick in the south zone, but you'll get some, and you'll be able to build a home. And so then instead of randomly spawning, you can spawn in your bed and, you know, things like that. And you'll get all your your uh, gear and stuff. I wasn't even dressed, you know, so... Um, anyway, that is arc for you. Uh, I guess I have to respawn before I can quit. Uh, anyway, I hope you liked this game. Uh, it is a fun game. Uh, it's definitely not one of my top favorites because the jump scare, uh, I like it to be more regular. And uh, it tends to be that uh, that seven days to die, the zombies all run at pretty much the same speed. So, All right. Thank you for watching. And until next time, I'll see you later.